they haven't done much in the games about the sort of antagonism that exists between city elves and Dalish elves. They've mentioned it in codex entries, but... I actually really like the Dalish banner is one of my favorite. I just really like how big the Frostback Basin one is, and it looks really cool. Mm, that one... Oh, that would be interesting. I can't in good conscience really, like, hang up a bunch of stuff about... I don't know. It's like they give you all these options, which I'm glad they do, but at the same time, it's like... Um... But I really, like, there's no reason really to almost sympathize with the Tevinter Imperium besides from liking Dorian. Um, but it's, putting that out as your banner or whatever is probably not a very good idea. People are like, ah, Tevinter's taking over, you know, and Parvolin, like, same thing. It's like, oh, probably not a very good idea, like, realistically to, like, stick that out somewhere. And sticking that out somewhere, people just be like, what? It really only makes sense to have the Inquisition banner but it's more fun to change it up but it'd be cool if you could like have an integrated banner like having inquisition symbols kind of mixed in with like a dalish one or like a dalish design a dalish designed inquisition symbol or something you know an inquisition symbol that incorporates dalish elven motifs or chantry motifs or something that would make sense to me these kind of they do not in a you know and I'm pretty sure that's not the symbol of the free marches. I'm pretty sure that's the symbol of Kirkwall. So, I don't know. I like my bed. I'm never changing the bed. Well, I mean, the Parvola one's cool, except for the fact that there are Kunari just, like, pulling your bed. Which I get it's supposed to be a boat, right? But it's kind of creepy. Um, drapery. I do like the drapery. I like the Frostback base and drapery. You can see it really well up by Vivian. It looks really cool. Heraldry. Oh, I didn't even. Oh, wait. Yeah, I did. Okay, and I had that hanging up for a while. The chasing. See, and the reason I like to use the Frostback Basin and the Parvolin is because they're very u different and unique compared to the other ones. The Zergold Magi one looks pretty cool, though. Winter Imperium Templar, Inquisition, Free Marches, Dwarven, Dalish. Basic. Ferelden. I don't know. Maybe we, let's check out. Let's see, you know, what other ones look like. I have that selected, but it won't be active until I complete the Grey Warden one. Yeah, I need to get the rest of the Chastened Throne. And I got the... Wait, no. I, I already... It said I got the Ferelden Throne, but I'm pretty sure I already had that. But maybe not. Dragon Maw, Inquisition, Chastened. Well, maybe some of this stuff will only pop up, like the little baskets or whatever, little face thing over there, will only pop up once you get actual decor. Window. Yeah, I haven't bought any other windows. I think this is supposed to be tracking, like, uh, moon cycles. That's what it kind of looks like. But it kind of looks like Easter eggs to me. I really like the Dalish one, so. Well, let's go see if this... Has anything for us? To step on your toes, you know. I am tempted to start so, to do some of the trials, but at the same time, I don't want to mess up my game, you know? So I'm like, I'm kind of like, eh. Okay, but we need to come in here because, and I need to get my pen and paper. Okay. Because I need to write down what I need. I should probably go pick the wither stock. Um, potions. Healing potion. I need prophet's laurel. So under potions, we have um, healing. Need five. Rough, it's Laurel. For healing. Um, regeneration potion. I need to get duration so I can get proximity heal. Oh, wait, I... Oh, no, wait, no, I need increased healing too, right? Yes, yes, yes. Alright, um... 
regeneration potion. I need two Prophet's Laurel. And then I'll be good to get Proximity Heal, where I will need um, 18 Arbor Blessing. Oh, that's... Increase healing to uh, to a meat vein. Uh, proximity heal. Um, I'm gonna remember the Lyrian potion, tonic, tears of the dead. I, okay. Oh. Oh, right, this is poison, the poison, poison, poison. Okay. Uh, and this is, what is this? These are tonics. Cheers of the dead. And maybe I should work um, work on rock. I mean, now that I have the guard ability thing, I, I'm okay. But it would still maybe be good to have for some, maybe for a mage, maybe for my mages. Uh, but we'll work on Tears of the Dead for sure. Um, increase duration. Needs twenty three blood lotus. I have eight and one dragon thorn. The thing is, I don't think I'm going to be able to get all of these at like once, you know. And Teven Fire and a Jar of Bees. I need to use Jar of Bees again. That's actually really useful. I need... Rash Vine. I need Ghoul's Beard. Ooh. I really need to work on Antiven Fire. I can get Shockwave. Rash Vine, Deep Mushroom, Ghoul's Beard, Blood Lotus, Dawn Lotus, Dragon. Ghoul's Beard and Vandal Ari and Felidar, which I believe you can only no, you can get some. You can for sure get some in the Empries, and you can also get some in um Where were we that one time? Jaws of a Con DLC. Um Frostback Basin. Needs Vandal Aria and Felindaris. Jar of bees. Embryum, which we're good on, freaking heck. <laughs> Deep mushroom and ghoul's beard, which we can get in. There's at least one or two we can get in the caves in the. Uh, not the waste. The Western Approach. Wither stock. Which I need to go get more of. Dragon Thorn, Blood Lord, Deep Mine. Freaking. Bandalaria and Felindaris. I also need to look up where to get the. I think some of them are like war table missions. Oh, also, I meant to say, um, at the beginning of an episode, so I don't know when this will be, but, um, uh, somebody in the comments, only one person brought this up, and I, I don't, I don't know if you want me to say your name on the, I, I just, I'm never sure if I should just blurt out names or whatnot, um, but, um, this person will know who they are, but they brought up the fact that the voice actor for Cullen was missing a while back, and I was trying to reply to your comment, 
but it won't let me. I don't know why, and I think it's happened before, and I've just, like, tried to, like, be right, or to write again in the comment section to, like, just be like, hey, I'm trying to respond to you. Just so you know, I'm not ignoring you. For some reason, no matter what page I go to, whether or not I click on it, or I don't know, anything I've tried, like the three different ways I can respond to comments, won't work. So, yeah, I did see that. I did see that he was missing, but he is back now and safe, apparently, and doing okay. He, like, wrote a letter or something I saw. Um, so I'm very glad. I was very worried about him. Um, I mean, I don't know the guy, obviously, but, you know, it's like... You just worry, especially, you just worry about anybody who's in that situation, but like, he means a lot to a lot of people, and so it was quite troubling, and, and you know, I hope he's doing all right, I hope that everything is gets resolved, and, and that he's happy, and <laughs> that things work out, but thank you for bringing that to my attention, I did, I did hear about that, and I was, I was quite concerned, so, sorry I won't let me respond to you personally, but... I don't know. I'll have to figure something out maybe <laughs> for that. But, alright, so now all we have to do is look up in the places where these things occur. Crestwood has elf root spinning weed, blood blood, this deep mushroom embryo iron. I think I might need to go to a different. Not here. Might need to go to Frostback Basin, Ravine, City State, Black Emporium, and I guess I could just go buy them probably too from the. I think, yeah, here's where we're gonna get Prophet's Laurel, and you also get Rash Vine Nettle, Arbor Blessing, which we need Blood Lotus. It's got Blood Lotus twice. I think I I think I saw that last time. Um, so the Emerald Graves looks like a good bet for. Um, let's see, E.G. next to Arbor Blessing. I don't know where Amity Vane is. Prophet's Laurels and E.G. I might have to wait until I get to the Empress to do that. Exalted Plains has the Black Lotus. Ghoul's Beard. Does it, did that one have Ghoul's Beard? I don't think so. Deep Mushroom. It also has Deep Mushroom. Uh, Rash Vine. It does not have Dragon Thorn, which is in the Forbidden Oasis for sure. Dawn Lotus is on the Storm Coast for sure. Vandal Aria. Oh, Vandal Aria is in the desert. In the I think it's in the Hissing Waste actually more than anything else. Felandaris, we know where Felandaris is. Exalted Plains, Blood Lotus. Oh, and the, uh, what's the place? Not the Fade. Um, Felmire has Dom Lotus. No. It does. Yeah, okay, it does. Okay. Elf Root, Spindleweed, Blood Lotus, Dragonthorn, Witherstock, Deep Mushroom. Hinterlands, uh, Storm Coast has, yep, Black Lotus. Oh, that's Olay, don't care. Some Bazaar. Western Approach has Dragonthorn, Witherstock, Deathroot, which we do need. Serpent Stone. Oh, we don't worry about that. Uh, Blood Lotus. Yeah, Western Approach doesn't have Vandal Aria. That's in the Hissing Waste. Okay. And Felandaris is in um there is definitely at least one place for it in Jaws of Akam, but it looks like we're gonna be good going to the Emerald Graves. Um for most of the things. I didn't even write down how many I need, which is probably stupid, but it's like so much to freaking write down. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just gonna work, run around and buy a whole bunch, or find a whole bunch of them. This really probably is best to do for a stream, but... Um... I think I kinda want, do I wanna play with... Yeah, I think I'm gonna mess with, um... 
Well, I get okay. We have jar. Okay, we can do jar of bees for me. And replenish, replenish. Um, and then hold up. Who do I want to bring out next? I want to bring out. Where are we gonna go to the Emerald Graves? Oh, uh, for sure we're gonna bring Solus. Um, let's give him rock armor. And the regen potion is useless at this point, but not useless, but yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not what I want. Jerpies. Uh, let's bring Cole out, and we'll give him what? Uh, we'll give him. Tears of the Dead. And also rock armor. Um, and who else? Let's bring Varric out. Varric. A ball Varric. We'll give him Tears of the Dead as well. Out of Blood Lotus now. And jar B. Nope, it all requires a bunch of freaking blood lotus. Okay, all right then. Wait, um, obsidian knight. I wanted to tint Sarah's. Because it's kind of plain, and she is not a plain woman. What's her favorite color? Does she have a favorite color? Like, oh, oops. Actually, that's. Oh, I want it to be empty. Oh well. Her pants. I always like to put Sarah in plaid weave. Honestly, she pulls it off like nobody else. Maybe plaid weave and red pants. Oh, we're out of my head. Why are we always out? It was like freaking pajamas. Uh, let's give her that. <laughs> I like dressing up Sarah because she can wear the coolest things, like, with no shame. Like, the funnest, the funnest, like, combination of things and no shame, you know? Freaking Phoenix scales. Green. I think once I dressed her up like Robin Hood, that was kind of fun. The blue, I mean, it'd be kind of cool maybe if the blues matched, but there's not really, I mean, that, but we'll give her that, I guess. Maybe, should we change the metal? Not really a big deal. No. Yay! Okay, so... Actually, actually, I'm gonna call this here for now. Well, no, you know, I, I'll just figure it out when I'm editing. We're just gonna go. We're gonna go to the Emerald Grave. Or should we? No, no, no. Okay, I lied, I lied. We need to go... Also, what I forgot that we did is we, uh, we promoted Barris and judge the mayor. That's what also happened while... Or when the when my audio stopped working, so so that was fun. But okay, so we need to go accept it from the war table. Should have been doing stuff. Should have been doing war table stuff while I was running around talking to people. Ooh, I like the Ferelden banner. That looks nice. Mhm. Mm that looks nice. I guess I have enough points that I could um. Open up a couple of areas, probably. Oh yeah, I have a point. Um, well, okay, there were several things I wanted. Uh, it, I'm not worried about the uh, inventory at this point. Exclusive game one combat ability point. Um, 
Mm, no, no. Oh, but oh, okay. Interesting. Skywatcher is with um, Josephine and the Enchanter. Okay. Who's with um Okay, got smuggler, speaker. All oh, right, I did do for her on purpose and witty writs. Um forward scouts, no, no. Enhanced studies. Ah. <laughs> No, I need, um... Right, I did want to do that. I also... I need to get focus stuff. Ooh, that would be good too. And more... Oh, but you need... Okay, so I was like, I was going to get more healing potions. But uh, I only have... Oh, I swear I got... Um... That guy from Leeds or whatever for Cullen. Maybe he didn't. Okay, so I could get the Masashi's methods for true grit. Um I I will get that. Okay, let's pick up stuff. Yeah. Enhanced chain lightning ring. Cool. Okay. I got gold. Yay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Did I not do that? I did. Alright, well, we'll check out other things first. We could open up the hissy waste. Um, or the empries. We could open up one or the other, not both. Right, okay, let's do that. Our retinue of our best. Inquisitor. Okay, and then... Let's see. Oh, I think we did. We found, yeah, found the mayor. Oh, no! So we sent out... Who did we send out, though? Leliana and... Okay, maybe we should do a couple of these. Suppose the double agent or... What is that? Oh, wow. Looks like she's the best for that. All right, let's do that. Let us begin. Okay, that's everybody. But I'm going to open up... Or should I? Should I open up? I could liberate the Empries, which is a very high-level area. Or the Hissing Waste. Or the... Yeah, no, yeah. Say, stop inventory activity in the west. I'm like, western approach. And wait, no. <laughs> oh, this is difficult. The hissing waste has the Vandal Aria, and they might have the Amity Vein as well. Um, but it doesn't have Felandaris, I don't think. Ooh, that's a tough one. Um, right, let's go with Hissing Waste, just because the Empress is such a high level. A large number of mages are excavating. Yeah, well, the mages aren't excavating. They're having slaves do it. New area. We will not gather. We will not go there yet, but... For now, we will go play in the Emerald Grapes. And we're gonna bring Varric, Cole, and Solus. Gosh dang it, we're going to die. I'm hoping to kind of just avoid most things, but we'll see. Did I get, I hope I gave Cole rock armor. 
I do wish they had the ability to control your party members like before, because I don't want to have to go to Cole every time and be like, take a rock armor potion, you know? 